And we're back, another week sitting down with Andre Yosibosh talking about all things last game, next game, and everything in between. So Andre, you guys on your first winning streak of the year, big win in Cleveland. How'd that feel getting the first division win in a place that, you know, it's been tough to get wins in recent years for the Bengals? Yeah, I mean, any AFC North game is going to be, you know, a hard-fought, you know, grindy victory. And, you know, we're happy we came away with the win there. And I think that, you know, we're on the path to, you know, winning a lot more. And so next up, you guys have the Eagles coming in to pay core. You know, I feel like your receiver rooms are kind of similar mm -hmm. in terms of, you know, two big names, then really good guys all throughout. When you kind of look at them, what do you see about the Eagles that interests you as a receiver? Yeah, I mean, obviously we have a lot of respect for their skill players. Um, and me specifically, I, I mean, A.J. Brown is one of my favorite receivers, or if not my favorite receiver in the league. Um, when I was in high school and college, I was watching him. Um, and then even now I'll watch his film just to study him, study him a lot. So that'll be like, I'll be maybe having a little bit of fanboy in me when I'm watching him. But I think our guys are just as good. And, um, you know, it's going to be a fun battle. And our coach had, had made a point to us this week, like, they have great guys, we have great guys, let's outperform them this week. So that's the goal. Is that something when you go up against a player that, you know, you looked up to, do you want to put up big numbers in that game so that, you know, you can go talk to them after the game? Um, not necessarily. I mean, I always want to put my best foot forward on the field, but I think it's more just, you know, yeah, I mean, you always got to put your best foot forward on the field. And, you know, when they, you know, when you become a big name, then people will notice you. All right. So you always put your best foot forward on the field, but you also do it before the game too. You know, we've seen some of your fits pulling up yes. to the stadiums, always got good style, always have good fits. Do you have the best style on the team? I would say I'm... I'm up there for sure. I, I think style is so subjective. Uh, and, you know, people thinking about those, those fits kind of, you know, some guys think they're on a runway. Whereas, okay, does he, he have good runway fashion or does he have, like, good going out fashion? Like, me personally, I wear clothes that I would go out in or I could be seen outside in. Whereas some other guys, like, if they were seen on, like, a fashion runway for, like, fashion week, then they would look great. But that's not my style. And I would say it would probably be, like, me, Jamar, Chase Brown, um, DJ Turner puts on some good some good suits. Um, Osai has good fits, and I'm probably missing someone that's gonna get hurt. I don't want anyone <laughs> to get butt hurt. So if <laughs> everyone has good stuff. All right, I feel like you were calling somebody out specifically with the runway style. Is that anyone on the team or in the league in general when you say that? Yeah, I think. I mean, I think uh, Jamar will wear stuff that I think Jamar wears more stuff that's like so unique that I would think it's runway. Maybe he would wear it out, but for me, I, in my mind, I think it's more run, runway. T also has good fashion, but Jamar definitely. He had these Rick Owens boots one time. <laughs> I was like, dude, I would never wear those, but he pulled them off great. But me personally, I I would never. <laughs> All right, what is the Andre Yosibosh style for people that don't know? What are you when you're in the store? Maybe even shout out some stores that you yeah. like going to. What are you looking for? Well, I think Air Forces are the best shoe of all time. I think you can get any Air Force, you know, all the all white Air Force with any fit. You can wear that almost with any fit, even almost with a suit. But any color variation of the Force is great. Um, and then I feel like those kind of jeans, like pants that kind of flare out a little bit at the bottom are kind yeah. of in style now. You know, not so much skinny jeans. Um, I feel like ones that are a little bit flary uh, work well. And then, I don't know, tops. You know, whatever top works, I think, I think as long as it looks good, then it's fine. But I think the flair with the forces, you can't go wrong with that for sure. Right, so I got to take notes. I'm going out right after this, buying <laughs> some flare pants and forces. <laughs> All right, so Sunday, Eagles, big win, right? Yeah, definitely. And it will be a great time, you know, all white with the home crowd there. We're looking for our first home win. So it will be a great day for that to happen. The all whites your favorites, or do you have a favorite uni combo? Yeah, the all whites. I mean, I think those are the one of the best uniforms in all of football. Not not even being biased. Even before I got to the Bengals, I'm like those were really nice. So, yeah, I'm excited to wear them. All right, looking forward to a big win for the Bengals. Thanks so much, Andre. Yep.